Office 365 has recently added some new features to its online products that will allow users to be able to have text read back to them. So for example, what I'm going to show you is a document that I have stored in my Office 365 account in OneDrive that we're going to open. And what this new feature allows us to do is have text read back to us as well as some other features. So we're going to open up our sample document and once it's opened we need to be able to get to the toolbar so we're going to click open and we're going to open in Word Online. So when we're in Word Online we now have all of our editing features we have our toolbar and if we come over here to this view menu you're going to see a new option that says immersive reader. Now you've seen in some of my previous videos that the learning tools feature available for OneNote gives you this immersive reader so that text can be read back to students and there's other features to it as well. So when we click on immersive reader you're going to see that your screen changes a little bit and the first time you launch it you'll get some tips up on your screen here. So down here we can enjoy, adjust some voice settings up here we can adjust text size space and over here the we can adjust the number of spacing of lines in between our text so when you're ready to listen you all you have to do is click play our heritage american our heritage american a treasure we all share our family trees have brought us so the default speed and the default voice are already chosen but if you want to change any of those features you can click on this little cog wheel over here and you can change the speed to faster you can change it to mail and then over here you also have some options to change the text size if you want to have the increased spacing which is automatically by default on if you can change that if you want it to be a little bit closer together you have two options for the font and then if you have somebody with some kind of visual issue they can also change the background to this to make it more a little bit more legible for them over here you can also turn on parts of speech so you can click this on and it will change the color of all the nouns or you can do verbs or adjectives you can do all of them at the same time and you also have the ability to turn on syllables and then this last one over here is line focus so that just changes what is highlighted on the screen as it is being read to you so if you want the focus to be specific on a specific line you can click on one of those things as well or we can just turn this off and then it's just a matter of our hitting heritage, play. American. Our heritage, American. So when you're ready to go back over into editing mode, all you have to do is click on this arrow and it will exit out and then you can go back to editing. So this is a nice little feature for any student that might need this.